hello everybody and welcome back thank you for joining me for some more adventures in ephemeral tell we are in the corrupted castle and in the last episode we took care of two of the ghosts that are found in here and we've got to find the other two now and hopefully actually some more elk bones so that we can feed the pupper some more that would be very fun to do so hopefully we can get some stuff done here and do well it seems like we're doing all right i was thinking a little earlier that we were doing a pretty good with our one hero here but i'm getting hurt pretty badly here we might have to pick up a companion very soon because we're getting a lot of damage off of us having another companion will help eliminate some of those some of that damage to us let's see what we can do about our items here our equipment one of our items broke and then we got something else burning ring would be nice leather gloves sapphire booties hike okay it must have not been those hiking boots are pretty good to be honest with you but i would really like to have something that had a little bit more durability i still haven't got any orange durability max durability accessories yet so those are going to keep breaking but we could we could move on oh no we do got one set of booties i didn't think we did well, no we picked up a cloak of some sort let's check that out i'm always curious to see what the new stuff and what we got we got a lot of new things here continuous victories empower enemies that's the thing i did not think it would be a good idea to have it would be the last thing is that our head oh it must have been our body that it was on tunic of the returned grants revive skill it's definitely good but it look at the defense it lowers her defense by 11 so i'm not sure i want to grab that i mean it's good but i don't know if it's that good oh there's the ghost let's go ahead and go fight him that's going to be an easy battle here hopefully they seem to be so far easy let's do some double strikes get this damage out pretty quickly usually our double strikes are a little bit less than our well we missed completely there yeah they're a little bit less than what your normal attacks are but because they do two it hits for a little bit more so let's go ahead and take him out but we're going to need some health here and that's going to be a problem because we are running low on health but we do have heal i'm not sure how much that heals us up N not quite enough definitely the potions heal up more this is going a little bit slower than previously so hopefully we'll be able to pull this off i'm running really low on magic here we're using it up quite quickly of course i'm not the one that has a bunch of magic to begin with i'm more of the straight up fighter here but i think we can get him down i think we have it it might actually give us up a level as well which will be nice the good thing also about the burn is that even if i miss i do some damage there oh my ever ever lit candle broke we have about seven of them though so that's definitely good we picked up several in the last episode see there's one at 14 and level 15. oh that's the butter knife everlet we only have one everlet candle left i thought we oh there we have oh we have one that is infinite durability that's awesome let's go with this one for now and then we'll probably pick up that orange one here after this one breaks this has been a very useful weapon here was this chest always here or is your mind playing tricks on you Oh, I got some kind of tome. I'm not sure what that is. That may be some kind of new item. 
translation tome allows the reader to speak with animals that's very interesting i'm curious how that will work or where that is used there are some treasure chests that come back or appear after you've been through the world before like your second entrance into the world so i'm curious if that was one of them and what that does i'm gonna push it i know oh we got yeah we're gonna die here but there's a reason here i want to die there is a reason i believe at some point when you die you get the healer companion that's the trigger i just gotta figure out when the death occurs is it against a boss after a certain level what's that condition that triggers that but it's always been previously after i've died let's see if she's not there yet so i'm really not sure what triggers her but we can do why we're here let's do some of these skill gym gets so that we can up our skills in the skill tree that's only three that's not very much but it gives us something let's get the defense up and then i'm going to do all oh, that hp up oh wait, well, yeah we can do magic up and then i'm actually going to give hp up and then we'll come back and get magic defense up I just I, that health is just so good it just really I think that good health is always better we got another El Cabone so let's feed it to the pupper I was in the way the last time so let's check it out this way yeah sure he seems awful happy about it and he loves me oh it offers something from its mouth a stimulant that's cool that helps my magic go up or refills my magic i believe that's what it does stimulate yeah maximum oh fallen comrade to maximum hp that's cool the magic water does the magic that's right if i feed him more i wonder if it's going to give me more items well, I'm gonna definitely have to check that out. Feed him as many bones as we can. Maybe it'll keep on upping the item that it gives us. And I mean, more items are definitely a good thing, especially if it's something we've never been able to use for before, like the El Cabone. So we're probably going to have to go back into the other ones and search a little bit because like i said there's those treasure chests oh this is a rare enemy she's going to give us if we kill it quick enough she'll give us a rare item and now it's not always a used item it might be something like what did we get potion primal jelly see that's something special that we got to figure out what it's done or what it is used for oh we got all kinds of stuff a cauldron crystallized essence yes we need that to open up the shop we don't have any comrades so that's not really helping us right now but we'll get it done we'll get a comrade at some point but that was a nice hit right off the bat the 141 crit we're just getting all kinds of items like i said it really is a large item centric game oh we got up a level sweet that just barely pushed us over a level i would like to explore as much as i can there was a down over here that's the benefit of searching a little bit there is that you can get these rare enemies that only come up every once in a while 
you get that special item from them. I'm hoping that I can kill these guys fairly quickly. I don't want one to come back. That looks like we got another pointed crown and he came back fairly quickly there. We're pretty hurt though. That's not good. My pig skin shield broke. Well, we're going to have to get some health here as well too. Is my primal jelly. What did this say? Strange substance found within the corrupted castle. That does it. Tell me at all what it does. Flask, yes. And body. What do we want to put on here? I'm not sure what's going to be the best. That has one durability left. Do we have anything that's infinite? That was pretty good. That's going to break soon. Hmm. Increase the chance to be targeted by 50%. That could be very useful if we have a low level comrade that we don't want to get hit. If we want to take all the damage, let's go with this bark skin chest piece. It's a level nine. We definitely need some better armor. We'll see if we can pick that up eventually. Does it see? I gotta see, like, there might be stuff hidden with or around the trees. Oh, there we go. Look at that. We're in somewhere new. Another hole, it looks like, that we ran into in one of the previous episodes. We fell in a hole, so we're gonna definitely have to look out for these places. Wow. There's some nasty hits here. Yeah, we're gonna need a comrade really soon, I think. Because we are getting tore up pretty badly in all these damage. Oh no. A mimic. That's not good for the health that we have right now. Come on, we could do this. I yeah, we're gonna have to fill up. Heal doesn't move us up quite as much, but it's enough to give us a little bit of a space there when you have that fire it's nice to have the fire because it does damage when you heal as well another mimic let's do yeah let's do a double strike oh a crit and a miss so he's on fire so it's going to do damage while i go to heal It's a lot easier when everything's on fire. That looks like everything there. Maybe we just need to walk behind every tree to see if we can find some more of these little holes. You can barely see it there. And it may have been there and I just didn't see it. Or mainly, maybe is only there if we fall into it. Oh, there's some more Elka bones. Awesome. I really would like to have some more bones. I am going to try to attack him and see if that fire is going to burn that other one up. The only problem with that is that he gets another attack if I try stuff like that. Oh, I got an item. He is not seeming to hit me or attacking me and then I hit him real hard. Oh, my wall of boots broke. Everything's breaking all at once. That's what happens when I switch things out about the same time. The chain link necklaces are pretty good, but I'm trying to see if I can find something like a little bit higher in level. That adds almost everything. That adds something to everything. I'm thinking that this one is better, the booties. 
and they're really close together but yeah i think the booties was a little bit better okay there's nothing down there i'm i gotta really keep my eye out for those holes oh that's just the portal again so we got oh that's right we did that in the last episode didn't we i want to see if there's any more holes i'm trying to see if there is a an image or a sprite a tile that looks like a it could fall through is kind of what i'm looking for or looking for a hole itself i don't know if it shows just a hole or not that vampire is bad he just steals my health he's not a very nice guy i think he'll burn up but i'm a little worried that he's going to heal back up from that hit yep don't see anything there i'm gonna use all my flasks here really too soon or before i get myself in trouble let's flip the switch let's see what the switch does oh it opens awesome i'm not sure what that does and i'm not sure i want to find out Oh, he's right there. Wonder what that portal takes me to. Does that take me back out? Or maybe takes me to the beginning. That's always a possibility as well. Come on, hit both times. Sweet. The other thing, good thing about the double strike is that it, there's two chances of critting, which is very useful as well. see like that that both critted both times which is going to really increase the damage i do so 75 doubled or 260s doubled really makes a big difference i almost got him here one more hit i think and then the fire yep there we go what do we get a masquerade well we got all the essences that's going to be oh Oh, it took us out. Oh, that's not what I expected. I'm kind of curious to see if I missed anything over there. I might not have like explored that. I saw that and the lever, but really didn't look around for anything else. We're gonna have to heal here. That's not gonna be good. That's gonna get us into trouble because we're starting off getting hit which is never a good thing and my magic heal is not a strong enough magic heal to really do much here we go that wasn't too difficult jeez all my stuff is breaking oh my head thing broke too I could do a cloakless hood and be infinite, but it's only level five. What else did we pick up down here? The masquerade grants the hill skill, but we already have that. Pointed helm, that does a lot, but only has 60 durability. It's a very low item. I just would like to have something a little bit higher in level the higher the level the better skill better positives it gives you when it adds stuff to your skills it was the lever and it was just that yeah it looks like it was just that portal okay just wanted to make sure So we got to be really careful. He's going to hit us and oh, we're going to die. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Very close to death. They hit me pretty hard and they have several attacks too. So it's pretty rough in here. I'm going to have to pick up, definitely pick up a companion very soon. 
Librarian's bookmark. I wonder what that does. Champion's belt. I guess that's definitely a very good item. Yeah, I mean Sure, why not? I mean, it, there's so many stuff here so much stuff here Yeah, I know I did that but I was I wanted to go through that that's quicker than walking all the way back around A dark energy emits from the doorway. Step through it. Sure, why not? <laughs> Psycho Pump Empress. I don't remember her, and I don't think at all I'm ready to fight her. This is going to go very badly, I think. I don't have any magic. I can throw, if I can get fire on her. There we go, she's ignited. We're gonna start doing a bunch of double strikes. I think will be the good way to do this. I'm doing good damage on her. The fire's doing an impressive amount of damage on her. She's growing in strength, which is not a good thing. I mean, I think that fire is the thing that's doing that 300 points of damage. But we've, oh wow, she hit me hard there. Do I have my fly? I don't have my flask anymore. I could heal myself again, but I don't think that really is going to help me much. I can let the fire kill her. <laughs> That's always the thing. Now she's not on fire anymore. Can I double strike? Let's go. Yeah, I think we've got her here. That was uh, that was a little worrisome there. Worried about how much we would do there or how well we would do there when I came in there with That low health there's an item at your feet You obtained the shard of primal blessing awesome. That's that And I do know like I said we can go back in the other areas We could actually fight the old bosses again if we wanted to but I think that's a good place to stop. We're going to look at our, not our equipment, our items. So some of the things that are used for not just you. We got the Tranquil Blessing. We're picking up the blessings. We know that the crystallized essence is for the shop guy. He needs so many of them. We'll probably have to come back in here and see if we can get some more. I'm not sure the essence the essence is there is what let us unlock that other part the primal blessing primal jelly i don't know what that does yet we had it in one of the other episodes or yeah one of the other series that we did but i couldn't figure out what it did i don't know what the translation tomb does cauldron does something again it's i think the cauldron is about Getting another companion, but I'm not a hundred percent sure We're gonna go there and end the episode and then in the next episode, I think We might open the last door, but I still want to go through these three areas again Because other stuff appears the second time you come in. So thank you so much for watching I do appreciate it and I will see you in the next episode Bye, everyone.